Hello and welcome to this video. Today we want to take a look at this trailer hitch right here and we want to install this trailer hitch on this Pontiac Vibe right here. Same thing as Toyota Matrix basically. It does come with six bolts, three on each side. But what you have to take into consideration is, first of all, the size of the bolts. These are 12 millimeters and they are 1.25 in pitch. They also come with these big fat washers, so that's good. These nubs go against the plate here. Now, something very important to keep in mind is you're gonna to need to buy a tap. This is a 12 millimeter tap, a 1.25 pitch. And this is necessary. Cars like this one, you end up getting a lot of rust in the weld nuts. So these are what the weld nuts look like right there. And I've already reamed these out with that tap, but they look quite rusty beforehand. So therefore, what you need to do is you need to take the tap, you need to get one of these T handles and put it in there and start tapping. I will show you how I did it. All right, so on these weld nuts, it's always a good idea to start them by hand like that and make sure they're going in straight. Now, before going ahead and doing this modification, make sure you're wearing gloves and also safety glasses because you will have some shrapnel coming down from those weld nuts as you're tapping through them. You might also need to dislodge your muffler. And in order to do that, I did spray first this post up there on both the left and the right side with some PB spray. And then I used a channel locks to kind of just leverage it out of place. When you're tapping, by the way, I've already tapped through this one, but what I wanna say is if it starts to get a bit difficult, right? then what I do is turn back a little bit to allow the shrapnel to kind of fall out. So just take your time because um, if you don't, you might snap one of these, okay? So just go slow, take your time, and yeah, just go forwards. If you, if you reach a tough spot, then go back a little bit like that, and then go forwards again. And doing that process, I was able to get all the way through what does also help a little bit is if you put some WD-40 or something like this PB blaster on there, you'll see that it's a little wet because I did spray it with that stuff. That does also help to dissolve the rust. And you see also I've got the car jacked up to give myself a little extra room here to work because particularly on this muffler side, there's not much room to even get to those weld nuts. All right, and then finally what you want to do once you get it on there, finger tight with these bolts is compress these washers here because they are kind of concave or convex however you look at it and snug those up all righty now we got that trailer hitch on there and we're good to go thanks for watching the video and i hope that it helped you